Let's come on over and sit down for IMAX. All right, great. Go in style, please. So um, I want to talk to you about something that, that maybe seems so basic, but it's so important, which is that you're not going to feel good about how well you do if you know you stink. Um, so if I get out there and I'm like, gonna do a new form but I haven't practiced it and I don't really know it yet and I get out there and try and do that at karate con championships or it's hard to feel good about it because you didn't earn the feeling good you know so for you to feel like a valuable team player you have to know your stuff you know I'm all for telling people they've done a good job when they've done a good job right and, and we're the same way. We should feel confident in the things that we have worked towards, that we've developed ourselves for, that we believe in ourselves for. But it's okay to, be, to acknowledge, hey, look, you know what? My Spanish is kind of weak. In fact, I know like four words. Um, I'm pretty sure I could count to five. Uh, now, I feel differently about my French, but my Spanish, I can acknowledge that's weak. And we shouldn't pretend, oh my gosh, I am awesome at Spanish when I'm not. Uh, so be honest with yourself and that's going to allow you to find your best place on a team. What are your strengths? What are your weaknesses? And just because you're weak at something now doesn't mean you're always going to be weak on it. You want to develop that growth mindset. You can be good at anything you put your mind to, but don't think you can just be good at anything just because you feel like it.